Welcome to the Minecraft Education Edition Boards, Posters and Slates tutorial. You don't have to be an expert in Minecraft to be able to lead a Minecraft lesson in the classroom. And learning how to use boards, posters and slates in Minecraft will give you the confidence to play, create and learn. So, get your mouse and keyboard ready and let's begin. This tutorial will introduce you to the multiple types of chalkboards and how to edit them. This is a board. It is three blocks wide by two blocks tall. It could be used to display information or allow for collaboration between multiple people. Look at the three different sizes of chalkboards and head through the open gate to the right of this board. This is a poster. It is two blocks wide and one block tall. This is a slate. It's only one block wide and one block tall. Okay. Let's head to the next section. After placing a chalkboard on a wall, open the editor by right clicking it. Type any text you'd like and then click the X in the top right corner to exit. For boards, you'll need to aim your cursor at the bottom middlemost block of the area you'd like it to occupy. For posters, aim at the leftmost block. Since slates are one by one, you simply need to aim at the block you want to place it on. We've given you three boards in your hotbar. Place them on the appropriately sized grey walls beside this sign. OK, let's have a go. Um, this one goes on the bottom middle. Uh, leftmost block goes here. And finally, for slates, just on a single block. OK, now let's go through to the next area. You can edit a chalkboard by aiming your cursor at it and right clicking. It will open back up the editor. You can also open up the immersive reader by aiming your cursor at it and pressing the I on your keyboard. This will bring up a separate interface that will read out the contents of the chalkboard. It will also give you contextual clues about the definition of a word by clicking on it. Try it out on this board. Let's do this now. The immersive reader can read out text by pressing the play button at the bottom. And if you click a word, it shows a picture. To return, click the left arrow on the reader. Lastly, the board says, place the provided chalkboards on the walls surrounding this board and try to edit them. Have a go at placing the boards, posters and slates. Write, edit and try out the immersive reader for yourself. And once you feel that you have the hang of it, press this button to complete the lesson.